Sent on their way from the 1400. McGogarty a little bit slow out of the gates. And until we dance is also slow and grand approach. Hello Lily is off and running and what an answer is right there shortly after the start. Uh, followed by Shikra. Pure Spice is on the outside of runners. Summer 69 is near the rail. They are followed further back in the field by Dirty Dancing. Jelly Lorem is on the outside with the black cab. They are followed by McGoggarty and Strong Vibes is near the rail. And then further back in the field is Leopard Liddy and then comes Grand Approach and Until We Dance. Pure Spice has won the battle for the lead. Pure Spice by one length. Hello Lily is back second. What an answer is in third position. Jelly Lorem is on the outside of runners and they'll follow further back by Dirty Dancing and McGoggarty. Summer 69's near the rail in the pink. Then comes Leopard Lily and Strong Vibes as they turn into the home stretch. What an answer in Pure Spice. Hello Lily moves through down the inside. Then Jelly Lorem. McGoggarty's now got about three lengths to make up and down the inside. Summer 69. 300 metres to go. Hello Lily, the leader. Jelly Lorem's on the outside and McGoggarty starts her run now. But it's Hello Lily over the last 100 metres. Hello Lily from McGoggarty who's running on with Jelly Lorem. But Hello Lily continues to find. And it's Hello Lily, Jelly Lorem. And comes McGoggarty. But it goes to Hello Lily. Second Jelly Lorem and then McGoggarty. So number 10 continues to find, and that is Hannah Lilly for Brian Bernard and Gavin Finzale, the AP answer. Keegan DeMello was prominent from a good draw, continues to find, and number 10, Hella Lilly, will prevail. This is her fifth time at the track, and she ends up winning at about three parts of a length. Second position will go to Jelly Lorem, who continues to stick her neck out, and number three runs second. McGoggarty will run into third position. The fourth placing will go to, also staying on nicely, Leopard Lily, and then came Shikra, further back until we dance, Grand Approach, Dirty Dancing, uh, then What an Answer, and they are followed by Summer 69, Strong Vibes, and Pure Spies. As we look at the head on, and Hello Lily continues to find that's on the left hand side, the white blaze nose band still under the hands at this stage is Hello Lily. And this one is bred by Clifton Stud. Jelly Lorem runs a nice race back in second, also from a wide draw, 72 days off the track. And the Gray McGoggarty stays on for that third position. Until the running of the third race, which will start off our place accumulator, back to the studio. Read by the Clifton Stud, the daughter of AP Answer. Her name is Hello Lily, and certainly she's put her hand up for the victory today, and she's fought on courageously. You must have been impressed the way that she kicked that last furlong when push came to shove. Yeah, um, in the parade ring, she was her demeanour was better. Last time she had her tail in the air, and um, I think she might have been slightly in season. I didn't see it obviously, but um, she, she, in the race itself, she was also running in snatches. And today in the parade ring, she had a better demeanour about it, and with and um, you know Brian was with us today and well done to Brian for another wonderful winner and he said to me your eyes even brighter you know she was she was she was looking good and um, so you know, we're very happy to have got this win you know under under the belt well done to Clifton Stud old Peter Blythe you know he's got this stallion a AP answer and I think he's, he's actually a horse that's that's a little undervalued at the moment he's gonna do better he's had a bit of a stop start start we've had a couple that have run well and now this winner again he's had a few winners so ho hope, uh, hopefully Peter that AP Answer gets on the go now and starts to roll them off, which I think he will. And of course to Keegan, a lovely ride. Well done to Keegan. And I'd like to compliment Gareth. I've been away in Johannesburg for quite a long time with the sales and other business that I have to attend to. And he's been training these horses for us at Summerfelt and doing a fantastic job. So well done to my son Gareth and his team back at Summerfelt. We really have got a lovely team going and I'm appreciative of the hard work that they do. Congratulations, all the best. Thanks very much and well done to Brian Bernard once again. He's really having a wonderful run. There we go. Thanks. One of the soldiers, Brian Bernard in Gavin Van Zale's stable, Keegan DeMello, 
take us through this ride. You've obviously ridden her before, so you knew a little bit about her. Yeah, you know, in the past, she's um, when she's been going around the bend, um, she, she hasn't jumped, you know. I rode her once down the straight, and she jumped pretty smartly with me, and then the next time she didn't jump with that Tindiwe. So today the main main goal was to just let her jump and um, have her as close as possible, and um, she, she got into a nice position and then um, started tagging me a bit. So when Anthony came around me and he got in front of me, she sort of dropped it on me, and I made my run pretty early because I knew she would stay on quite nicely and, and she did just that. You got a couple of each way shots coming up, horses like Ramp, Diva and one or two others, how do you rate them, Kadji and the likes? Yeah, you know, um, don't forget the one in the next four, Uncle Brian and Mr. Van Zell, you know, um, the wide draw is a concern but she's improving fully but just hopefully she can overcome the draw and um, Ramp, Diva, last time on, in, in that inside draw, um, nothing went away, she got a little bit of kickback and she, she was very dumb around this turn so um, just hopefully she can bring back her form. Well done. Thank you very much. And well done to Uncle Brian and his family, you know, for always giving me the support. And um, thanks to the whole uh, Mr. Van Zell team. Thanks for the support. Well done to Jockey Keegan the Mello. Let's get Brian Bernard into the picture. Now, it's amazing these telltale signs you pick up the R's, the coat, and one or two little extra things when you're on course. Yeah, Charlotte, I don't know. It might just be one of those things that I've been born with. But yeah, I saw a demeanor today. I actually said to Gavin, I'm sure she'll win today. So, yeah, we're happy about that one. She dug down that last furlong, so it's encouraging? Very, yes. No, she showed some guts today. Yeah, very encouraging. You might have another one to come, according to Keegan, in the next. Let's hope. It's just the draw we're worrying about. But, yeah, she should be right there. Well done. Enjoy the victory. Thank you. And well done to Gavin and the whole team and to Keegan for a very good ride. Thanks. Well done to Brian Bernard, Gavin Van Zale, and Keegan de Mello. Hello, Lily. She's kept on plugging away that last furlong. And you heard from Keegan de Mello. Keep a close eye on their runner. And the next is drawn out a bit deep, but they give this one a sneaky chance.